Hello and welcome to Ready Player Dumb. We are playing Until Dawn. Yeah. And uh, shit's going cray cray. Yeah. Yeah, if Chris was alive, he probably would have gone with Ashley when they broke off. So we need to either go left or right. Mike's going... He's going his way. Yeah. I mean, like, I think you could either go, go either way, but I'm not sure. No, I'm going this way. I want out. That's not me. There we go. Are you sad that Sam's not still in a towel? Shit. Me too. This looks like Hannah's writing. Uh oh. Day one. My little sister is dead. The fall killed her. I watched the color drain from her face. My leg is broken. I'm all alone. Um, stuck here with Beth. Um, someone will. Someday. I hope that someone will find us, maybe. I've never been so hungry. It feels like my stomach is twisting around inside. I took Beth's sweater, much warmer. Now she's still looking out for me. Wait, they were both alive? Beth died. Hannah survived the fall. Oh, that's what she means by she's still looking out for me. Is mm -hmm. like, so I wonder where this is going. Yeah. I'm sorry, Beth. I have no choice. I'm dying. It's the only way I can survive. It's the only way I can survive anymore. If someone finds this, I'm sorry. I had to. I had no choice. What does it mean? Jesus. Could have. She could have not written anything, and people wouldn't be like, "Well, judgy." But then we wouldn't get this. Flavor text. <laughs> I know. My hands feel unclean. My nails fell out, pushed out. I am aching, but no more cold, no pain. I'm getting stronger. Uh oh. Hungry, 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 hungry. Uh oh. Yeah, so that's it. Uh oh. <laughs> oh gosh, it makes sense. I think. Hannah. Dug up Beth. It was Hannah. No, that's, Michael, that's ridiculous. Michael, it has to be. It's the only thing that makes sense. Hannah did what? Died Dug up Beth fall. and ate her. So what? What does that mean? So Hannah must have buried her. God damn it. God damn it. Hannah was down here. I don't believe any of this. She would have been starving. She would have been desperate. Fuck! We need to find Josh. Right now. We made it in. So I think maybe you have to get back in the water to go the other direction. So that was like a whole like, hey, good job for coming over here. Yeah. That's a pretty big thing to miss if yeah. you miss it. Mm -hmm. Wow. So, yeah. So she... May have turned into a windy go. A windy go. I don't think it's a may at this point. I'm pretty sure she did. Oh okay. dear. Do games like this make you hungry? Like I could just eat a big old steak. <laughs> <laughs> a raw steak. <laughs> The audio yeah. sounds we made it. Sounds like something else. What is that door for? The only thing. It is the only thing. Ah, two. It's Jess. It's Jess. So those are the. Oh. 
Do you think that's her? Yeah, I think that's... That's her. <laughs> yeah. What the fuck? Oh, oh, wait! Oh boy. You ready? No. Oh, Josh? Hey! I don't take orders from you! Uh oh. You can't, you can't tell me what to do! You can't Josh. tell me what to do Buddy. anymore! You can't tell me what to do! Oh, okay. Okay. I trust you. I trust you. I trust you. The end. Oh! 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 oh. It's a oh, he's tripping or something. Josh! <laughs> Mike! Josh! Hey, man! Don't... Don't hit, hit me, please, please. Well, you were deep in it, man. Full mental jacket. We didn't think we'd get you back. Josh. Hannah was down here for... Weeks? A month? She dug us up. Sam. Mike. Hey, let's just get the fuck out of here. Okay, Josh, do you have the key for the cable car? Uh, yeah. Oh, God. You see that over there? That means there's a direct way out. Come on. Yeah. <laughs> there's no way Josh is going to make it up there. Okay, if you help me up, I can go back to tell the others we're okay. Yeah. Bring Josh back the way we came and walk. Be careful. As in, uh, after that. <laughs> Alright, let's go. You People that are MIA. Where did Ashley go again? I, uh, she went off some other direction. Down in the mines. She's all by herself. Yeah. And they. That <sighs> was not a good idea. Godspeed, Bill Grubb. Uh, yeah, um, I'm sorry about before, man. I, I thought you killed Jess. I was wrong. So grab that totem. So they just apologized? Yeah. Did Josh apologize? I think Josh said something and Mike apologized for it. Fortune totem. Kind of seemed like Sam was staying still. So if Sam stays still, he looks should be good. <laughs> <laughs> well, now Josh is gonna see everybody. <laughs> this won't be good for his brain. He might I honestly just be like, oh. Anything? No. <laughs> okay, I guess I guess we're going this way. So who do we have here? Jess, Emily, Chris, and, uh, and uh, oh, that's it. Flamethrower, dude. I think that was. Is that Chris? Yeah, that's Chris. Okay. I don't know where Flamethrower, dude, man. That's that's what's interesting about this. It's almost like it might be the consciousness of Hannah yeah. gathering everyone up. Like yeah. she wouldn't care about the Flamethrower guy. No. If anything, Flamethrower guy should get a pass from her because he tried to help. <laughs> Unless she doesn't realize that. Pretty impressive that these things didn't show up until like 50 years later, though. Yeah. Like, flamethrower guys, like, yeah, we've had some problems. Yeah. And the game's like. Yeah, I don't know how long the Washingtons have owned this property on the on the mountain. Huh, huh. 
<sighs> we did see that there was a Wendigo in the water earlier. We sure did. We sure did. Godspeed, Pilgrim. Catch a break. His neck was Mike trembling. Okay. Can't get scared. How did Mike end up being okay? I don't know. I think. Hey, Matthew. Long time no see, my man. How you been doing? I don't even remember the last thing he saw. Uh, he jumped, and I think he saw Emily fall down the ravine. So that's about it. Wink. Let's see how Matt's gonna fare. He just <laughs> dies immediately. Alright, Matt, what's up? <laughs> Not much. Right, that's locked. The elevator? So, so was it a, a Wendigo that was going after them? Emily and Matt? Um, Presumably? Yeah. Man, do you have to walk so slow? <laughs> He's like, yes. He really has no idea what's been going on. Yeah. Where you go? I'm just saying. Oh. I'm just a looking. Anything good over here? Guess not. Guess not. <laughs> All right, Matt. Not Panama Matt. Because you don't have a Panama hat. Not tall enough either. Nope. And he's not a lawyer. Nope. Did Matt play sports? I know he does uh, fencing. He did fencing but was for he a little bit. He I did. don't think he did sports in school. But maybe he did. I don't know. The Matt doesn't... He doesn't <laughs> strike me as a sports person. What was that? Which way? Hide or run? They still probably. Yeah. But I wouldn't know that. See? We know what we're doing. Okay. We're gonna keep this boy alive. I got you, Matt. Jeez. You're gonna be my Chris replacement. <laughs> Truth be told. I didn't have an issue with Matt. He was Two hands on the controller. Break through or keep running? Let's just go run. Off! 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 <laughs> Damn it! Yeah. Uh, what is. Okay. Yeah, okay. Man. I didn't really, know what that was for. Yeah, it was really abstract as to what it was supposed to be for. Alright. Good thing you did it. Dawn! is almost done. Matt! Um, how the hell... Oh, I thought I thought she was, like, falling. Yeah, she's climbing up. Climber jump. That was just climbing. Okay. Oops. Truth be told, I thought I pressed climb. No, oh, you definitely pointed it towards climb. Ooh. Ooh. Climb around or grab overhand. 
Don't take your hand off the fucking controller. <laughs> I spawned a John. <laughs> you think I learned by now? No, you don't. You never learn. <laughs> don't take your hands off of the controller. That's not my flash. Oh, it is my flashlight. Totem. Oh. I just think you can take either way, probably. What if I go this way? Well, that's back to where you went, came from. But how? Because it's just an island in the middle of that pathway that you just took. I am pathway. the island in the sun. Wow, you took a circle. There you go. Congratulations. Thanks. I am an explorer. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's this way. Let's see what's no. over here. Uh, no. You're walking around again. Stop. You were so calm that I was literally walking back. Like, I love that you were just <laughs> like, um, you're walking back. Like, it, it wasn't even a... F was that a shadow on the other side? I think. But I... I, I think, maybe. It, was. I think I it was. Now we're seeing things. We're freaking out. All right, under the tree or through the... Is that an option? I don't know. No. no. Again, just loops you back to the main path. Stupid that you were birds. On. Forward. I'm gonna go no. forward. I just want to see if if there was anything I walked. I would have missed over here. You never know. There might have been a totem. Right. No. Turn around. Turn around. So much time. It's not wasting when you're having fun. Who's having fun? <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> Someone's been here. Look, footprints. Oh, must have been you. Oh. She must be so cold. Like, I don't know yeah. if the clothes she's wearing. It's good. It, ca it can't be good for like no. this kind of weather. No. She's probably cold. It's a tidbit and nipply. Especially that now that she's wet from the waist down. And she's about to get more wet, it looks yeah. like. Yeah. If you know what I mean. I can't speak for girls, but mm -hmm. I know as a guy, that is just a devastating moment. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Was that your, your impression? For guys. <laughs> <laughs> All right, forward. She was off. <laughs> There's nothing there. Go don't forget. At some, go. At, <laughs> I don't know. At some point, uh -huh. I need to stay still. Yeah. But it looked, I think that was, that was at the cabin. That was inside. Yeah. We're not even safe inside the cabin anymore. We're not safe anywhere. Let's go. Let's walk into the rhythm of the music. <laughs> Drop down. That's a far way to go. Oh, we're going. Ow. Ow. Okay. Could have been worse. Yeah. I was very worried about her tailbone. Yeah. But I guess we're fine. Is this where Josh was? That might be right. That might be where he was. What are you saying? Uh oh. We're moving a lot. Uh oh. Triangle. Uh oh. Uh oh. Going. Uh oh. Just remember two hands. I got both hands. Uh oh. 
Matt or Ashley, are you back at the house? Someone, please. Someone, please. Hey. Mike. Oh gosh, you look terrible. It's gonna look worse if we stay out here. Come on. She's, he really has been through the ringer. Yeah. Are you gonna say anything, Mike? Mike, what happened to Josh? I got him. God, what an awful way to go. <laughs> so he didn't. He Not didn't good. actually. No. He didn't actually see what that. Uh, it was Hannah. We should check your basement. No. Might be someone left down there. Check the basement. Is that what he said? I guess. Um, well, I mean, the basement was the safest place to be before we left it. Oh, like, that'd be down it here. Just... Yeah. Oh, there you are, Mike. Yeah. Is Matt or Ashley gonna show up? It's like Chris pops out. Hey, guys. Thank oh, God. he's decapitated. How do you rate our chances of survival? Mm -hmm. I'm trying not to think about it. Okay. Oh, run! Run! Run, hello? Hello? Oh, okay. <laughs> Woo! They're like, what are you doing? I mean, they're gonna eventually break out of there. Yeah, but. Yeah. Gives me a minute. Uh, Ashley? 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 What's Ashley doing? I don't know. Oh, she stopped. Because of that. Alright, we gotta stay still. I started, I started laughing, <laughs> to be honest with you. Yeah. I was like, duh, duh. What's going on? Okay, get ready for a don't move. I'm pretty sure you're gonna have to continue. Should I just put it down? <laughs> oh! What the hell? Ooh, oh, we're about to blow shit up. So I, do, I do remember. Was, <laughs> I, love how yeah, slow. I do remember how there was a death totem with Mike and him setting the fire, but that was with his lighter and not with the. Hang in there, hang in the there, door. Sarah. Ooh. So is this is this Hannah? The big one's Hannah. Yeah. Is that? Is, I wonder if that's good for us. Oh, don't do it with your hand. <laughs> that can hurt. What else was he gonna do? There goes Ashley. Yeah, that's a smart move, Ashley. Get out of there. Well, get ready to stay still with Mike. Go save Mike or run to switch. Oh, man. I don't know how we can save Mike. Let's oh. fucking try! <laughs> Mm -hmm. 
You gotta make a decision, my boy. It's hard because if you yeah. breathe, it throws yeah. it off. Yeah. Run or hide. You should probably run now. Yeah, now I'm, <laughs> I'm done. I'm done standing still. Yeah! Run, 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 run. Mike, get out of the house. I thought it was going to be like, oh, yeah, the power's off. Okay. Did Mike, Mike just die? Yeah. He didn't get out of the house because he's a fucking idiot. <laughs> I tried. He's the one that set the trap. I tried to hide, or I tried to save him. There's, yeah. I, I don't know what else I would have done. Kept hiding? I guess. Is there anything I could have done to save Mike? I'm pretty sure that everybody can survive. Dawn. Let's pick him up. Yeah, I'm pretty sure everybody can potentially survive. So. Don't tell me that. I don't know, but that it's so unclear what I could have done yeah. to have saved because I, I literally. Yeah. No. Is this showing all the death scenes? Yeah. Sure is. Right. Screw you, game. Died at four thirty. No. Screw you, game. No. Where's Jesse? So, what are we? T no! That that's an interesting spot where it ended. I feel like I have a lot of questions. There's, yeah, there's a there's stuff after. This. There's more. Okay. He was my best friend, and maybe I. I never had a chance. I was right there, and I could have done something. I tried to do something. It wasn't good enough. No, we, we, we didn't. didn't. We didn't. <laughs> I thought we were close. After his sister's disappeared, he'd come and talk to me. He said I was the only one who understood him. I thought. I thought we had a connection. If you need someone to talk to... I'm fine. Sometimes, after a traumatic experience... I said I'm fine. I heard Jessica. I don't know how or why she was down there, but I know I heard her. You read about why you heard her. Yeah. It was my fault Mike died. I wasn't supposed to move. But I did. Did it, was that, was that clear? And he no. saved me. So it's my fault that he died. I, I stabbed him and I tried to get away, but I didn't know. I swear I didn't know. Didn't know? Who did you stab? Oh, I, I, I stabbed the maniac. I didn't know it was Josh, but then he was the psycho. And how was I supposed to know Josh had all the sauce and the gun and all the gun? You need to listen to me. I don't care if you believe me or not. It doesn't matter because you will. You need to go down to the mines. What's in the mines, Sam? I've seen what's down there. And I'd give anything to unsee it. Saxon the dog is in the credits. So there's, all right, now is a good time to talk about your feelings. There is more, so there's more after the credits. So it seems like if Sam's a little um, PO'd and also off kilter because of the events. Um, I guess mm -hmm. Mike did say, don't move. Don't fucking move. I just I, I didn't realize that meant the whole time. Yeah. 
Yeah. I mean, it, I think the that game was just a hard one because she obviously under. And I mean, like, I think the game purposely sometimes makes things a little bit ambiguous. Ambiguous. Yeah. And you go, oh. Because yeah. I tried, I tried to help Mike live. Um, but yeah, I was like, I, I was honestly, like, I didn't want to have, like, not saying I rank lives, but mm -hmm. I think I would have preferred Sam make it yeah. versus her dying Mike make it. Yeah. So I was like, come on. And it just, I honestly didn't know if the game was literally going to be like, you can keep freaking staying still, mm -hmm. but you're... I'm just trying to think of what the alternative was going to be because they were going to blow up the house. Yeah, I think it was just more of like you would have to just stay still until Mike was ready to leave the house. Which, like, I feel like if you're seeing Sam run for the switch, you you just do it. You, you, go. you go out the back door like Ashley did, or you jump through a window. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so the whole time that I was staying still, were you able to see Mike? No. Okay. No. Could you were, you made were, a comment during that. No. Uh, no, there was a couple of moments where like there was the one moment where you're you shout at Hannah when they go Hannah and it's she's headed towards you and you can see Mike in the background. So how many how many people mm -hmm. did I start with? Seven, I think. So there was Did I do Josh, did I do bad? Definitely. So <laughs> Josh Sam, Mike, Ashley, Jessica, Emily, Matt. Did I do Chris? bad? Wait, did I come clear? I don't remember. Josh. Do them in pairs. Mike okay. and Jess. Mike and Jess. Uh, Emily and Matt. Um, uh, Mike and Jessica. Was that not the first two you said? Sam and Jessica. Fuck. <laughs> I thought you, I thought it was the other, well, you said Very it, important. so then I didn't count it. Mike and Jess. Mike and Jess. <laughs> Chris and Ashley, Sam and Josh, Matt and Emily, so eight of them. So I of I them. made it with three, and you're saying that I could have made it with eight. So, um, so did I do, like. I, I, I think. I think it's seven that are for sure you can save. Okay. So, so, okay. So that being said, yeah. with three surviving, mm -hmm. how is that? Pretty bad. Pretty bad. <laughs> can we, can we at least agree that it would have been four if the trigger button didn't screw me yeah. up? Like Emily, I totally deserved yeah. to have died. Cause I just straight up stopped looking and yeah. paying attention. Yeah. Um, Jess, I just I just wasn't fast we enough did, with the buttons. Yeah, we made one mistake. Um, and then Chris was the other one. Yeah. Wait. Oh, wait. Am I forgetting one? Emily. Oh, and, Chris. and Mike. Mike was yeah, Mike. was a death that I was like, Ooh. Yeah. Um so okay, so anyways, I and you mentioned that there's something after this. Yeah. And I, I kind of don't want to give my full thoughts yet. Okay. Because because of that, but I'll give my general thoughts first. Mm -hmm. Uh, is that this game, A, I, I absolutely adore that this game is set up to have this domino or butterfly effect yeah. um, that, you know, certain decisions lead to other decisions. I've always enjoyed that in games. And I, I love that a lot of games that I've had that mix in with doesn't always have this factor to it where you have a lot of action, suspense, um, you know, crazy moments and mm -hmm. I really liked that yeah. you know I obviously gave my thoughts real time on on that one trigger moment not working yeah. and you know I get that sometimes not often mm -hmm. but like there might have been a microwave radiation <laughs> thing going through right at the moment I was pressing that button and I didn't get to save Chris yeah just something goofed um so you know, I, I acknowledge that, like, something, it could have been on our end. Uh, it could have been. We know that the games had the issue with some other people mm -hmm. to have that happen. Mm -hmm. um, but that was a one-off. That only happened once. Yeah. It happened at a very crucial moment, but it only happened once. Yeah. Um, 
So yeah, no, I I thought until dawn it was it was just fun. I really enjoyed uh, the characters that they have you go through. Yeah. I enjoy that it has you play as every character. I enjoy that it it basically says like, look, their lives are in your hands, yeah. and this is up to you to uh, you know have them survive. Um, and and yeah, I mean it's it's. It is. It's got challenge to it yeah. uh, because it's a very spontaneous game. There are moments where you don't know, like, am I gonna have to do something? Don't press I'm not pressing okay. anything. Don't worry. Uh oh. I think I got my answer. So that that was that was something I caused. Um, mm, it said butterfly effect. Yeah. Effect update. Um, you can go to um, status and collectibles. Okay. You can go up to the the very end. This one. The yeah. result of chaos. Yeah. Sam escaped. Mike died in lodge. Uh, flip the butterfly. Man. Yeah. Ashley escaped. Flip again. Okay, again. Yeah. Okay. Uh -huh. Okay. That's it. Oh, okay. Weird. I um, wonder if it just means that, like, it shows what. So what? Ha so if everyone survived, does he have anyone to eat? Um, I think because he was chewing on the, the flame throw man's head. Oh, I think he? there's at least that thing. Okay. So I think, I feel like this happens no matter what i okay. might be wrong okay so that was going to be my last bit i i wanted to get into the story and that's that i was going to say that left some questions open which specifically i'm like what happened to josh um oh, here we go here's uh, so there's a what is this josh heard the truth about the monster josh recognized hannah and hannah recognized josh josh was alive trapped in cannibalistic so uh, was there any way to save josh i don't I don't know. I can look that up real quick if you want to. Because I can't think of. About, yeah. I don't, I don't think you can. But no, I, I enjoyed it. Um, I, I, I do question. Like I don't know what the. You might know better than this about the replayability of a game like this. Yeah. Since you know that you could have different outcomes. Yeah. Like I'm sure, like the challenge would be, going through and then saying, "Hey, this time we're gonna make everybody live," but if you screw up once. You'd probably be very upset. <laughs> so, so yeah. So, um, but but I, I like that whole whole effect to it. I enjoyed the uh, the the totems getting thrown in. It just had a lot of good like side moments. The story was was fun for mm -hmm. for a horror type story. Like mm -hmm. you said, it had its campiness uh, okay. that that has people enjoying these type of movies. Yeah. You can't save Josh. He can either die in two ways. He can either become a Wendigo, or his head is crushed by a water, like a watermelon, by Hannah as a Wendigo. So I think what it's saying in the important discovery thing is since Sam knew that Hannah was down there, therefore ate Beth, mm -hmm. became a Wendigo. You told Josh she was able to tell Josh the truth about Hannah, and so, so in, in that moment when he's like Hannah. When the window go came, so so if that if yeah. he didn't if he if wasn't he didn't, told yeah if he wasn't told he would have been squished he would have been killed. But now he's a and window. and honestly, my question to you is, was this a better outcome uh, to have him become a Wendigo and then start killing? <laughs> I don't more people? think so. Um, so there is now a thing where you can go back to certain episodes. So there is that, but it so doesn't it, it won't change anything. Right. I I think select an episode to replay and change the story. So but you have to like completely restart the like episode. It, you you have to you restart it, the episode and then I I would guess that it would affect yeah. everything forward. Which episode was it 8 that started with the 
them going. With yeah, the Emily died right? in the same okay. episode that we lost Chris. Yeah. So. Um, I mean. But yeah, so you can jump back at any point. But I mean, like, unless you go all the way back to where you can save Jess, it, you've got a lot to play through in order for it to save. <laughs> Gotta save everybody! Yeah, I just. I don't know how it works as far as, like, if you jump in here, save Jess, and then you, like, jump here. I don't know if it actually... It might remember it that you saved Jess that time, but then you're probably... If you just skip around, you're probably missing a bunch of dialogue. Yeah, no, I'm sure I'm sure it's... Well, again, Jess was literally the first person that we lost. Yeah. So... And, and the thing is, too, like, like, that's the problem, is if I ever go back to this game, I have to almost remember, like, uh, what stuff... Did I really want to not have happen? <laughs> but no, it was fun. It was a good game. What do you, What do you think of this game? Uh, I enjoy it. Um, I I really I I like the like the initial campiness of it, and then it like it's almost like um this is gonna be a weird comparison, but like you know the song "Poor Unfortunate Souls," where it starts off just kind of like. And then by the end of it, it's like, <laughs> you know, it's like, it really builds up yeah. where it's just like, it starts off like, oh, you know, like there's some small jump scare pranks, you know, and then it just compl like, it keeps on going and ramping mm. up and ramping up and ramping up. And then, and then, you know. So, yeah. So I said this early in the gameplay where I said, oh, I think I have theories yeah. Of what's going on, uh -huh. and my my theory was that Josh was behind the stuff. Yeah. Um, needless to say, I did not anticipate Wendigo showing up. Yeah. So. Yeah, the it, game throws that extra little curve. Well, it's good because it, with the Josh stuff that's going on, mm -hmm. my thing that I was thinking of was like, okay, I get it. Yeah. If it's him doing it, but how is he getting all over the place like this? Like that's pretty crazy. Yeah. And it gets explained basically because oh, he's definitely not the only one in there. So. Yeah. Hi. What's really, what's really weird to me is that, um, like, um, and for for Matt and Emily, it probably was circumstantial, uh, circumstantial, but I feel like the people who got pranked, quote unquote, pranked the less least were the people that were more so in the forefront of the prank, you know, like Mike. Yeah, Mike and Jessica. She orchestrated it. Um, it was all her idea, and then I mean Emily was also like kind of you know she was the one dating Mike, so she was also like yeah let's do this prank yeah um, and yeah so like Mike, Jess, and Emily, as far as like when it came to Josh, they got off kind of easy because like Mike and Jess went off to their own cabin. I don't know if he had anything set up for them. But and then it got derailed because uh, because he revealed himself too early, I guess. Yeah. But I guess yeah. here's another question I have about this game with oh. survivors. So like Jess, let's say she lived, mm -hmm. would she have had more opportunities to die later in the game, or is it like if you get past your moment of you're probably gonna die? Um, I f I feel like she probably would have had more moments. Might have killed her. Does that mean that the longer people survive, the longer the game actually lasts? Maybe. I don't know. Because with Jess, I think if she's... Okay, so the thing with Jess is is that either if she actually is dead or if she's just like, um, you know, in that totem where like she gets up and she's like in her under or whatever and she's looking around. Whichever way the whole thing where she's sitting on the elevator, she's either going to be dead or she's going to be alive, but the elevator does fall. So M Mike always believes that Jess is dead and th therefore is like, you know, angry with Josh. He's always going to believe that Jess is dead, but there is an instance where okay. she will be alive. She just has to get out of the mines herself. Gotcha. Um, but yeah, that's that's how that kind of like strings... So I, I was wondering how much how much of a shift the game does have based off of who's dying. Yeah. Um, but yeah, I, I I just like I said, I enjoy that. I find it very fun as a yeah. gamer. This game did not pose. It posed different challenges. Like the yeah. honestly, you'd be surprised. Mm -hmm. Maybe I'm just a 
a weakling, but you'd be surprised how hard it is to actually sit still. Yeah. <laughs> it, it is tough. It's, like, it is it's tough. It's very sensitive. Um, yeah. Yeah. The problem is you can't just put it down because it might be like, now press circle. Shit. <laughs> yeah. Um, but yeah, no, I had fun. I enjoyed it. I, I enjoyed, like you talked about at the beginning, how they have those, like, the characters are very, it's almost like putting actors and actresses into yeah. into the game. So I'm like, yeah, they even, they have a whole bunch of stuff that shows how they made this game and yeah. stuff, like the actors acting it out. So is there no way for us to, well, I guess the way you do it. Is to replay and collect all the yeah. tokens. So what are the, so it's saying we had two things that we didn't get? So... Yeah, I mean, it might have been because someone died that was part of that. Ooh. All right. Yeah. Well, uh, that's until dawn. Uh, do you have any last thoughts? Um, no, I just think it's a it's a really good. It's one. It's a different kind of game. It's very unique, and I think it deserves the praise that it got for that sort of unique. Yeah. Um, style of gameplay, the way the story unfolds, and all that stuff. How would you rate my game play of it? How did I do? I, you know, there were a lot of times where I was wishing that you just didn't have to do your hair or just because <laughs> you were you kept taking your hands off the controller at the very key moments that were like, oh, there's going to be a lot of quick time events. Well, let's ask the doctor how I yeah. did. Did I do good? Thank you. Mm -hmm. Did I do bad? <laughs> you did all right. <laughs> so like sideways. Swoosh. Shoo. All right. Well, folks, again, that was Until Dawn, part of our spooky season. This, this, uh, I wouldn't put it out of the realm that this wouldn't be a game in the future yeah. that we Attempts. could revisit. Yeah. Um, and like you said, do our best to... Save everybody. Save everybody. But I tried this time. Yeah. I tried. I tried this time. Yeah. Um, so, yeah. Who knows? Uh, again, uh, we'll see how the replayability factor. It really, sometimes like with a game like this, I think it, it comes with time. Yeah. Where it's like, let it sit for a while and maybe come back to it. But that was Until Dawn. I recommend it. Yeah. Um, you know, you've seen, if you've watched the gameplay here obviously there's things that you're going to know about the game but there's still a lot of there's, there's still things that yeah you could potentially unlock by doing better at not killing people. yeah you yeah so so there, <laughs> there's a lot of interactivity to it um and it also seems like the kind of game that you could choose how long or quick it goes <laughs> yeah so just kill everybody in the game <laughs> <laughs> is there is there an op is there a so I, I keep asking about survivability, uh -huh. but is there a way that everyone's dead before you even get to the house at the end? Oh, oh, at the end. Um, I don't know. Potentially. Hannah walks in. Yeah, I, I oh. don't know what happens in the scenario in which everybody's dead. I don't know what happens. Maybe that's what we'll figure out next time. <laughs> uh, but we're Ready Player Down. Want to say a big thank you again to our patrons um, and all their support. Uh, also, a huge thank you to our viewers, subscribers. Thank you guys for uh, continuing to watch. And we love reading the comments and, yeah. and keeping up with the interactability. And, of course, keep an eye on whenever we have live streams coming on out. Uh, always have fun with you all yeah. there as well. We're ready, Player Dumb. This was Until Dawn, and that is a wrap. We will see you next time for the next game. Ooh. Oh, and... Godspeed, Pilgrim! <laughs>